All right, we're recording. We're recording. I don't think this will be a YouTube video, but I want to... Okay, so we're going to talk about this message, and I'm going to send it to them directly. <laughs> so the question that someone asked in the Discord... Um... Uh, da, 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 da. I uh, okay. Is it normal to be angry and hate the artists, mostly those who are at the same age like you, even if they did nothing to you? For that, why you can't for for that why you can't create the art at the same level like them? So basically, do you hate the artists that they are better at making art than you? It's a funny topic because. It's it's such a it's such a real answer or a real question, because <laughs> it's like, yeah, I I I get I get jealous and I and I get um I get mad at seeing other artists. Um, so like, this is definitely like an emotional like trigger. This is like an emotional like thing, right? So like, how do I feel when I see an artist that do that does work better than me? And I think I can like give a good example because most. Oh, my chicken's ready! Ah, we gotta hold on. Hold on, I'm not ready. Wait, a pause. I got, I got this meat. I got my chicken. Hold on, I'll answer the question. I'll answer. I'll continue the question after I eat. All right. Sorry about that. So, back to what I was saying. It's an emotional. Um, it is an emotional kind of like anger, because yeah. Uh, someone's the same age as me, or younger, and they, they do better art. Quote unquote better art. I, I want to also just kind of say that, like, because I, I, I know, like, sometimes you can think, like, objectively someone makes better art than you, but, like, it really is, like, sometimes, like, some people do like your simple work, or, like, they like seeing your work, even, even as you're improving. Now, there, there is some things we have to talk about with, like, people being better than you with art. And it's just that, sadly, life is unfair. Some people have resources where they, they, they are in a good situation where they can study art at a, at a good pace. Um, I was in that position, but I abused it. But, like... Also, like, some people probably were, are better at, at, at teach, at learning this stuff, too. Like, they were able to absorb the information better. And, like, it just is what it is. And some people are lucky enough, like the, like the kid that did that Lego scene, like in Spider, in the new Spider-Verse movie, a 14-year-old made that piece. But, to me, that doesn't matter. And... What I'm going to say might be, like, I think it's the most healthy thing. But you can't be, like, absorbed or so fixated on other people's successes and other people's accomplishments. Because if you do, you really lose track in your own development. And I feel like you as an artist, like... You, you like in and it, I don't think even like this this I don't even think this applies to just art this applies to like anything you're chasing for like if someone's better at you as in sports someone's better at you in like like school I think you really just cannot be you can't be fixated in everyone else it's very easy to be fixated in, their, in everyone else because it's like everyone will just be like oh look at you doing Look at this person, they did this, look at this person, they did that, and then it's just like, you you don't want to look. Like, really, what you shouldn't do is you shouldn't look. You should just be looking at, like, yourself and, and like, doing your thing. Because, like, you know that cheesy saying where it's, you're not this person, you're you. It sadly is kind of true, because at the end of the day, like, a person follows you, or they like you, or they hire you for whatever you make. Now, there is exceptions to this, because some people, like if you go work for a video game job, a corporate job, they hire you for their tasks. So like if you go work for Blizzard, you're just goblin drawer number four. Now, sometimes this isn't like this. 
because they do hire some people do hire you for your individual individuality or whatever that word is or they hire you because you just make good work so like so let i am kind of getting on a tangent here but like if you get caught up on other people's successes it's just very toxic and it's not like a very it's not very good um and what you said uh clip uh chip mcfluffy uh yeah if you get caught up in that mess you'll just fall behind on any subject yeah so it's like let me like like a lot of artists i that a lot of artists i follow are like the same age as me and they are already in like career paths that are just like yeah so like if i can just like maybe get an example a good example is taryn because taryn's one year younger than me and I really, like, I started taking serious art seriously when I, you know, when I saw Taryn's work. So, like, you know, for example, a lot of people know Taryn, right? Saudi or gifted a tier I... sub to DRRP Dingo. They have given 10 gift subs. Thank you, thank you. Oh, shit, I'm on my not safe for work account. Ah! Hold on. <laughs> Enos. Enos. Let's see. <laughs> so anyway so yeah like <laughs> balls so like taryn's work really sparked a lot into me because it it was a good like hit to the face being like man i got to start doing work i need to work right and taryn's the same age as me well he's younger he's one year younger than me and so how do I feel about that? How did I feel about that when I saw his work? I was pretty pissed because I'm just like, how the fuck does he just do it? And like, I do, I, I, I delve into everyone's work, you know? Like I see their process, I'm, I'm asking what brush they use. I, I'm, I'm, I'm like, I'm scrolling through their Twitter, I'm asking everything. I actually never directly asked him anything because I'm always nervous to ask anyone anything. But I found myself realizing the more I do this, there is some value into doing that. Taryn does some great work, I know. So there is some value in like learning their workflow. But what's more valuable is you doing like your own studying. And like, like you can learn from them and like why they do the things they do. Like, like for example, like, um, like for example, like I'll I'll look at his work and I'll see how he does things. And then like you know, I can take from this and like, you know, just like see what he does, do a study, I guess you could say do a master study, and then move on with it. A big point of what I'm like trying to like say is you have to like I feel like with everything you do, like especially with like art, is getting rid of like an emotional attachment with like other people with their work and just like instead of just like being like emotional about like their success i found that being really really excited for their success and like happy that this sounds weird but like i'm more happy that they're successful what they do I find that being in like that mental state is like, I can, I can take it, I, I can learn and absorb much easier. If I'm just negative and mad, I feel like I don't learn. Like, for example, like here is, here is one of my favorite pieces that he did and during Weartober. I thought it was really good. And so, um, I believe I did this during he has many pieces like this but uh like i just showed you guys um i have like done some influence like you know there's like there is some influence with this and like i feel like i wouldn't have developed as much as i have done over one year of doing freelance if i was just like a negative nancy i know i'm joking all the time and i'm sarcastic like when I'm like, oh, my work's bad and stuff. But it's just like, I, I don't like, I, I like to be humble. I like to just stay studious. I like to stay learning. I like to stay positive. Even though I sound like a negative Nancy. But like, um, it's like, 
how can I be happy about my own successes and my own small accomplishments? Because you're never going to jump from like 1 to 1,000. You're going to jump from 1 to 2 to 3 to 5 to 8. You also might regress. Re regression is a regression is normal. Like so for example, what it's what's it like when you regress or like any kind of like developmental skill is like uh in a uh, time and this is a uh, it fuck fuck okay th th this one is all right all right I'll, I'll, I'll do it like this improve fuck you guys probably know where i'm going with this improvement so so like as time goes you do get better but with these like pitfalls you do kind of regress but then sometimes oh wow look at that and then it's just yeah like this is what it's like like that's what that's what like skills are like with that shit my graph would be a horizontal line and sometimes what if you're like that like if you're just if you're like this this is what happens if you keep being negative really because a big part of like you getting better and just to, just to make this clear the people who have gotten good they've they've done this road they have done this R just you're see remember the work you're seeing from them is the iceberg effect uh this is the work you're seeing uh the work you see and this is the work Fuck, the work you don't see. Yeah. So like understand that the artist you you're you're mad at, <laughs> that's the Titanic scene too. Yeah, yeah. The the artist you're mad at, they've done this. They they've done this road. But if you're if you're like right here and you're mad at seeing their stuff and you know, you're gonna just like kind of flatline and you don't develop. Instead, you're gonna like just try and you're gonna try and like get, you know, you're gonna try and copy them, which is fine. Copying is fine to study. But you're gonna get mad because you failed at like, at like replicating them. Imagine trying to replicate like a Dave Raposa piece or something else and, and you get mad because you didn't make it exactly like it. Like that's just insane. They've done, they're, le they're level 70, they're a level 70 paladin, and you're just a level 23 guy with no gold. Like, you gotta, you do have to understand that they, they, that, like, you have to kind of go on this road where you do have to, like, you know, you do have to appreciate the work that people have done. You do. And you have to be just, you have to just be positive about it. Because... At the end of the day, you can just easily do it the same. You can. It's not a it's not a dead end road, you know, you're not it's not bad. It's a it's a such a big mind shift change. So like, yeah, you spent more time being bad, but you can get good. And like, I feel like to get good. Or like, I, I I feel like I feel like getting good is one thing, but the but the big important thing is like your goal with like how, what do you want like what so like when you get here so what's next right, and that's like the harder thing to like actually deal deal with. So like, I do know that it is a very so like yes. I, I still get jealous. I still get envious seeing people do amazing work. Mr. Morty, do you want to go outside? Okay, Mr. Morty wants to go outside. So I'll, I'll uh, finalize this real quick. But I do get jealous. I do when I see people do great work. But it, but it almost immediately goes away because I get kind of excited seeing that they have developed and seeing what they've done. 
I remember when I watched uh, Dave Greco, I saw I saw his style just get better. And I think maybe some of you guys can like see it too. Like when you guys maybe see me get better, I think like some of you guys get excited just be like, oh wow, he's getting better. Oh wow, he's getting faster. I get like that for every one of you too. Whenever I see you guys like posting in the Discord, I remember I remember like uh, seeing like when I see you guys like art, like in here. I remember seeing uh, I like seeing like you know I like seeing you guys work. I remember seeing Zakarthus' werewolf piece. Yeah, this one. I remember seeing Zakarthus werewolf piece. And I'm like, oh wow, that's so much better. Whoa. Uh, seeing Toasty's little piece. I was like, oh, that's so beautiful. And it's like, then I see this loser. <laughs> so it's like, like, a lot of artists are in their own head. And you guys really have to understand that, like, people, like, people will scroll through your work like this. People just scroll over. And so do not worry about other people. Don't worry about, like, if other people are succeeding. Because, like, you should just be worried about yourself and if you're succeeding. Like, like... Uh, excuse me, you should be worried about yourself and like looking at the things you've done that are good because you guys have done things that are good I might not see it Like I might not see the work, but you guys have have to do be like something like you guys are proud at with like your work so, Like for example like for me, I'm proud that I made this background better uh, uh, da, da, da. Oh This this is an old one so, like, I'm proud that I made this background better, and I think I'm making this piece better. I think this piece looks way better with the with the composition. For the, this one, for example. This one I did today. I was happy I did this in a day. I was happy I did this... And, like, I know this might be look like... This might be a really good piece. And you know what I did with this piece, by the way? I used a reference to help me. Uh, to get the colors. Um, I used, uh... Well, already behold... I used uh, Taryn's Moo picture because I wanted I wanted to see like I knew what to look for when I saw this. I wanted a desaturated sky with with uh, orange with orange light, and so I just kind of took that reference and I just applied it because I learned from that piece and just like yeah, all every artist learned from each other. And instead of, like, looking at people, looking at artists as your enemy, you gotta just kind of look at them like, like they're gonna help you. They might not respond to you because we're fucking busy, we're streaming, we're, we, we have contracts or NDA things, like, like, we, we have, like, you know, everyone has, like, busy life. So, like, people can't, like, message back and stuff. So, like, be respectful that, like, some people can't, like, get to you, you know? Like, if I can't message you, like, that's a thing. So, like, yeah. Be be excited for other artists. L and, and, like, l you know, like, learn from the pieces that they make. But it is normal to get mad at them. I, I still, I, I, I very, I, yeah, <laughs> it is normal. <laughs>